Uh, the big news that kind of developed a little more over the weekend is the news about Shohei Otani. Shohei is shutting it down for the year. The oblique injury uh, just kept lingering and it got to a point where it was just time to shut it down. It was absolutely the, the right decision. He's going to be out for the remainder of the season. Did an emergency podcast all about this on Saturday and everything I know and, and, and everything I know about the injury and his future and, and all of that stuff. So did an emergency podcast on Saturday. Uh, but yeah, Shohei is done for the season. And this basically just allows it. Look, it's, it's unfortunate. The oblique injury sucks and obliques are a, a nightmare. They just continue to linger. And at this point, though, he clearly wanted to play. It felt like every single night he was still trying to get back in the lineup, trying, trying, trying to get back. And it just never ended up happening. And it was time to, to shut it down. Uh, but it does allow him to make the the decision and, and to figure out what he's going to do with his uh, it, it allowed him to be able to, to get it done earlier, right. To be able to get the UCL taken care of quicker and be able to come back sooner from it. So it made sense all across the board, but that was the, some big news that happened over the weekend, which leads perfectly into some Monday reactions. And we're going to start with the AL MVP. The AL MVP race is over. Do not make a mistake about this. Make no mistake about it. The American League MVP is Shohei Otani's. It's done. He will win it. He will win it handily, in my opinion. Uh, look, it, th the big difference here is, or, or the big reasoning I say that is because when you look at the numbers that Corey Seager has been putting up, Great. And if it were over the course of a full season, absolutely. The conversation becomes very difficult, but Corey Seager also missed a lot of time. And I just, I don't think there's any way that Shohei isn't the MVP this year. I think it is done. And I really don't think it'll be close. Ultimately ended up with 44 homers, 95 RBIs hit over 300, 304 on the season and OPS over a thousand. Those offensive numbers is he was he would have been the MVP in baseball in the American league had he not thrown a single pitch all year, but he did to the tune of a 3.14 ERA, a 184 batting average against he dominated on the mound. And, um, it was just, we were on pace to see one of the best. We were on pace to see the best season of all time. I said that about 2021 when he was the MVP that year, that was the greatest season we've ever seen. Well, this was going to one up one up that what he what he did offensively this year was absolutely remarkable. So uh, yes, there are some other players having great seasons. Uh, Corey Seager being the the one that really sticks out to me that it should absolutely be in the MVP conversation. But the AL MVP race, this news Shohei being shut down for the remainder of the season doesn't affect it. Shohei is the MVP of this season. 